My name is Monica Dufo, and I'm the director of Hair and Tortoise. It's really looking at friendship and how people can be different but still be friends. Hair, of course, is always approaching things with speed and wanting to win and wanting to be the best. And Tortoise sees life in a different way and approaches life with maybe more attention, maybe more in the moment, a little more present in what's happening right in front of her. So the two of them go through the seasons together. As that happens, we see them be friends even though they're approaching things in different ways. I think it really appeals to little kids and their understanding of time. Just wait a minute or hang on, we'll do that in a few minutes. And, but this play explores it in a really beautiful and playful way. Hare is always having to wait and to wait and to wait and wondering when is it going to be next? When does that happen? So that's something that I think kids can relate to and they understand and they're encouraging Hare to that he can do it, he can wait. The play and the music in the play are enchanting and playful and fun and the kids enjoy all of those elements but there are opportunities for them to also participate. They do the movements that Hare does when he does his victory dance. Tortoise is getting ready for the big race and she does some training to get ready. The kids do those actions along with Tortoise and Hare. So Carousel Players brings our shows to schools all over the Niagara region and all over Southern Ontario, but we also perform the show in performing arts centers or theaters, libraries, different venues, so that there can be family audiences as well as school audiences. Children adore this show. They love to participate. They cheer hair and tortoise on. They love to interject. They're active audience members when they see hair and tortoise. The world was winter, shivery shaking, tortoise waking, sound and stretching. Hair was waiting, wishing, wondering, when will tortoise wake?